Hello YouTube, this is Asatsu5 and today I'm reviewing the William Henry um, uh, well, William Henry knives in general. This is the Cressilus or something. This is actually the um, Jurassic. It's a limited edition. Um, I think this is number 6 of 25. It has um, Mammoth Tooth, Makunigami, Mike Norris, Damascus, uh, a diamond right there. And to get to the uh, main point of the uh, review, it used to have a diamond right there in the button lock. But uh, the diamond fell out. This is a $1,500 knife. The most expensive knife I ever bought. Had to put it on layaway for a long time. Beautiful, beautiful knife. But the um, main point I want to make is that although this knife is extremely beautiful, it's $1,500 and the diamonds do have the ability to fall out, which sucks. Um, doesn't necessarily give you a, a superior cutting experience. Um, by the way, the sheath is uh, ostrich skin with um, um, sterling silver. The bell is sterling silver. The bees are sterling silver. And, um, you know, if you need a really dressy knife and you have more money than cents, I would say go ahead and do this. It's beautiful. Uh, it'll probably do everything you need it to do. But because of this particular model, how small the blade is, uh, which is good for cutting string, opening up packages and stuff, but it's not really good enough for food prep. Uh, or it's not big enough for food prep or tactical uses or heavy duty cutting task. And if you accidentally cut ribbon with uh, metal wire in it, it will actually chip the edge, which has happened to me. I had to have my brother repair the edge on this. So um, long story short, very beautiful. Uh, amazing work of art. But is it worth it? Uh, I don't know. So that's it. I love it, but I, re I regret spending the money on it. I'm a Sasu 5 and I'm out.